Hello and welcome to a LEGO City Starter Set. This is set 60136. I really like these starter sets. And a little thing that I found a bit curious, LEGO's also selling a, uh, a Prison Island pack, which just has like four minifigures without any extra stuff. And it costs double the price of this thing. I don't get it. Um, it's not like uh, LEGO City Police you know, minifigure designs are that special, like superheroes, like, oh my god, it's a pack, or like Star Wars, where it's a pack of like Boba Fett and Darth Vader or something, and, and two, two Stormtroopers. No, it's just like, here's two generic cops and two generic prisoners. Why does that cost like double the price, when you can also at the same time get something like this, which is half the price, and you get like a little Khan background piece. Weird. But I'm still very happy with this newer box design, where I can just cut the tape. I, I messed up the tape, but that's okay, because I'm not keeping this box. It's going in the recycle bin. Uh, well, not the recycle bin, I actually want to use this to post something, just as like a box or something. On the back shows you the minifigures in clear view, as well as uh, images of what you can do with it. There's a dog in the back of the car or something. And of course it has a tiny instruction booklet, uh, which tells you how to build the thing. And it's very easy, very easy to build, very straightforward. Might be a little bit too easy, I get it. This set is probably aimed at even younger people, but uh, each step, each page, uh, they really could have halved this book. Uh, in size. A parts guide on the back as well as uh, this advertise. No, it doesn't advertise other LEGO sets, but it just uh, advertises LEGO Worlds, which um, I don't know, I'm playing Minecraft. I don't need another one of these games, and I haven't even played Minecraft for a long time already. So, yeah. Whatever. So, the set itself, you get two main pieces inside, uh, aside from the actual figures. So, you have a little car here, which is actually pretty cool. Um, you can clip on some of the extra accessories on the back, and of course you can clip the dog there, or stand two minifigures on the back. Uh, but there's no way to transport the uh, the bad guys after you catch them. Well, what are you thinking, Lego? Oh, come on. <laughs> uh, so you have a printed piece here with uh, Lego Police. That's fine. And to the car, the car's okay. I I actually kind of like this. It's not that bad. Hmm. I'm, I'm sick of vehicles and stuff, but that one's okay. Uh, you have a little uh, ATM, which is useful uh, for, like, if you have, even if you have modular sets, it's useful just to plump this in the middle somewhere. It's like, hey, look, there's an ATM here. For some reason, uh, this doesn't say ATM, they just put a $100 bill piece on the front here, just to signal, hey, this is the ATM. Would have been better if it was just says ATM, but whatever. Uh, some Even though it's such a simple piece, there's some nice details here, like this blue 1 by 2 plate in there. That's nice because it does have a gimmick going on. You have, and you gotta get the money out from the back here if you want to. Just open up this. Come on. There you go. You open up and you get two extra bills in there. Uh, or you can push this big red button or we move it and it pops out and the, the bank, the robbery, it's like, oh, let's take this away. So, uh, yeah. I'm trying to stick in little gimmicks, even such a small set, is, uh, that's okay, I guess. It doesn't actually get in the way of the design, so it's okay. So if it, if it did get in the way of the design, then that'd be annoying, but it doesn't. So you can just remove that piece and it'd be fine. So here are the characters you get. A standard police doggy. Uh, hmm. The eyes are actually more cute now. It's, well, it's just a light and angle, I guess, but um, they look a little bit different from the previous doggies, but hey. Standard uh, Lego dog police dog thing. Uh, so you got uh, it, two male and two female, You got and goes two bad guys and two good guys. Uh, red and green, interesting. This is, must be the Mario siblings. <laughs> so uh, yeah, standard cop body, uh, very standard, but the hat has the cop logo printed on there, that's pretty cool. Uh, female face there, and a pretty pretty elaborate uh, female body. And you got a drill here for drilling the money out, I guess. Uh, very evil face. Uh, for the woman, surprisingly more evil than the guy, the dynamite for him, he's got a little walkie talkie and of course uh, on the car there was another uh... <laughs> damn, what do you call those? crap, I forgot the name uh... handcuffs, yeah, and of course she's holding handcuffs as well <laughs> so you got that going on, uh, yeah uh, they look pretty good. They're pretty nice figures. Um, I mean, they're very standard, but they're still pretty nice. And um, these two are wearing underneath their overalls. They're wearing still wearing the striped uh, prison clothing. And um, here's what she looks like on the back. Uh, no, no back prints or anything. But uh, the design of the uh, no back head print. I mean, the design of the outfit's been nice. Uh, the thief guy has a backpack that can hold two plates in there. And he does have some extra detail on the back body though, even though he's got that backpack going on. Oh, again, pretty nice. He's got a little bit of red paint brush thing going on. Why does he have a red paint brush? <gasps> That's blood. 
because Lego can't say it's blood, so they put a paintbrush there. Uh, police has a radio on the back. Unfortunately, the radio is cut off because it doesn't have any leg, back leg printing. Uh, same goes for the lady, and both of these radios say channel eight. So, uh, so what does have a back? What, is, what, is, what, what does he have a back radio and another radio like walkie-talkie that he's holding? That's uh, weird. So yeah, uh, this is a nice little Lego City Police starter set. If you don't have any of those starter sets yet, then they pick it up. If you do have some of the bigger sets, there's also a very nice little add-on to those sets. I feel like there's enough minifigures in this small box to justify it. If there are only three figures, I'd be like, eh. If there are five figures, I'd be really happy. Did they ever release one with five figures? No, I can't remember. Uh, but four's a good number for such a cheap set, a small set. And I think it's a nice little... Uh, nice little set that's quite great and you can also uh, use this as like mini gifts for for that Lego fan that you know because you, you can never have too many generic characters in, in a Lego collector's Lego player's life so this is one of those nice packs that you can definitely get for them and uh, the, the accessories, the ATM is a pretty good build and fit anywhere and the little vehicle is actually quite nice it's, it actually feel, almost feels like it makes sense uh, for such a small Lego vehicle vehicle sometimes they give you it and it feels a bit weird like oh, what's the one I'm supposed to do it's like a little buggy or something that's weird but no this one's pretty cool uh, I would have preferred it if the vehicle was not a vehicle instead the budget went into like more set piece stuff uh, but uh, they're not gonna do that because I keep thinking our oh, kids need vehicles to play around with so let's got to put some of those in uh, oh well subscribe suggestion comment below and of course take care and have a nice day bye bye